Right, Peg. Hello? <laughs> Are you ringing? <laughs> it's me! <laughs> David? Hello? Did you die? <sighs> it's me, Maurice! Your best friend! I'm imaginary! Maurice? I didn't recognise you. Your, your face, your... You're old. You should have a look at yourself. You look like a deflated jacket potato. <clears throat> no, not like that. I can't. I'm imaginary. <sighs> you need to make the noises. Glug. Glug, glug. Cheers. Cheers. Clink. Clink. That's what lemonade's that. No offence, but I thought I outgrew you. I used to get out lots, but then you stopped imagining me. I don't know why. So then I was stuck inside your head. Then one day this door opens and I thought to myself, here's your chance, Maurice. Walked through it, didn't I? You were in my head for 60 years. Yes. Was there much to do in there? Oh, a lot. Have an imaginary wife, couple of imaginary kids, imaginary Labrador, the whole imaginary kitten caboodle. Really? Nah. You? Oh. Well, I was married. Peggy. She's gone now. Um, I'm feeling a bit tired. I I think I'll get my head down for a bit. Hey! Look, if you've got a problem, go sleep on the sofa. Why can't it be tomorrow now? Good morning! <laughs> You're it! <laughs> so this box hits the food? That's right. Yeah. Wow, how does it do that? Well, it, I'm not sure really. Something to do with waves, I think. Well, they all look delicious. I can't wait to try some. Oh no, where can Maurice be? Do you ever wonder, who's that old guy and how did he get here? Pioing, pioing, pioing! David, David, David! You're under attack! Oh no, machine gun! David! What? You're on the attack, you're not really doing anything! Brrrr. Oh no! Oh. Ha! Got you, White Law! <laughs> Something wrong with your imaginary breakfast? No. What's wrong? Nothing. God. Maurice. Why don't we ever leave the house? Oh. Why would you want to? I mean, I, I, I've got a man that uh, brings me everything I need. We, we don't want for anything. Eat your breakfast. Where are you going? I'm opening the door and we're going out. Oh. Let's go to the park or, or France. How much is this ticket to Antarctica? No, 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 just get away from there, please. Get away. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Maurice. I, I, I can't. I can't. You used to be fun. I'm making a mess. What does it look like? Yes, but why? Ah, I can't do it. 
Stop there and now here. We have to leave. One day it's just going to be one of those sad old people on the news that dies and nobody knows. I, I can't. I mean, this place, Peggy, her, her clothes, her things. What if we run out of time and end up being chewed up by moths? Look, Margaret, Margaret J. Hardcastle. It's my Peggy. Letters to a dead woman. There's no, no, no pe Stop it. Shut up. You, you just don't understand. What do I forget? I forget her voice, her, her smell, what, what it felt like to hold her hands. I mean, one day the letters will stop and I'll forget. And she really will be gone. Why did it have to be you? Why couldn't it have been her? She's not just bits of clothes and missent post. She was real. She lived and she died. That, that's what people do. And staying here isn't going to make her alive. But, but you know that. That's why I'm here. I'm, I'm just imaginary. Don't trap yourself in here. Live. Mm. Step through that door with me. Go live whatever life you want to, I don't care. But David! Just go! So, where to first? 